quick live uh, update from what's going on in AI in Singapore. And this is a real background, it's not a fake background. Um, yesterday, February 19th, uh, Deputy Prime Minister in Singapore announced another big move on AI of, of Singapore with the announcement of a, a billion Singapore dollar investment over the next three to five years. So that's roughly 750 million US dollars of investment on AI. One may say that's yet in just another country pushing on this AI topic. Fair, but I want to highlight two differences that I find very interesting in the approach. One is the business pull on AI. They, uh, Singapore insists on the fact that AI is to transform regular businesses that are actually based in Singapore. And again, they find a smart way of doing it. They've launched a few years back this uh, program called 100 AI Experiments. And the logic is to fund companies who have an idea with, uh, on the topic of AI with a potential payback of less than three years. If companies are able to frame properly this AI application, then the government will fund part of the talents to build the use case, build the application, and contribute through uh, open source code um, to the community related to AI after this project is actually done. So that's the first example. The second thing that is also interesting on, on the approach here is obviously regulation. Uh, Singapore is a pivot um, between the East and the West, between China and, and the rest of the world. And on regulation, again, they found a pragmatic approach. They have offered and rolled out in May 2022, and now it's, it's publicly rolled out, a protocol for AI governance. It's already an MVP uh, that companies can test, or so a number of companies here, Meta, Google, DBS, and others have actually tested it, rolling it out to basically um, uh, test this regulation framework, uh, AI regulation framework, on all AI applications built by the company. In the context of EU Act on AI, that's another interesting concrete application on how companies need to start monitoring all their AI and governing all their AI applications within the company. This is uh, live from Singapore on Data and AI. Take care.